Let's quickly talk about SAML and SCIM. These are both available for GitHub Enterprise Cloud and GitHub Enterprise Server. Um, just remember that these are features specifically to enterprise and just have a general understanding the difference between the two. So SAML stands for Security Assertion Markup Language. It is an open standard for exchanging authentication authorization between an identity provider and a service provider. It's an important use case for SAML is single sign-on via the browser. If you don't know what single sign-on is, it's where you use one account to log in and then you're logged in everywhere else. And so if you want to have single sign-on, the mechanism they're using here is SAML. Then you have SCIM. So this is stands for System of Cross-Domain Identity Management. It's an open standard for automating the exchange of user identity information across different identity management systems. A key use for SCIM is to enable scalable and automated user provisioning and deprovisioning, often integrated with enterprise identity services. I know that's a mouthful, but I got a simpler summary for you here. SAML is about securely transmitting user authentication and authorization data for single sign-on purposes. And SCIM is about managing user identities across different systems to simplify account maintenance provisioning. So if you remember those two at the bottom, you'll know what they are. Um, they didn't really ask, at least I didn't get any questions that had to distinguish between the two. It was more so, you know, where are these features available? And it was for both the enterprise cloud and enterprise server. Um, and one other thing I want to just note is that these two, uh, these two things can complement each other in the same ecosystem because they're doing two different things, um, uh, serving two different purposes. So just understand that they co-mingle co um, and that this is for enterprises, okay?